Developers don't need to worry about sizing storage or compute. Azure Cosmos DB automatically distributes resources, providing both exceptional performance and dynamic scalability with high availability and low latency service level agreements. Plus, developers can start with a serverless option for cost savings and scale automatically as their needs grow. Welcome back to the Azure Central Show. I'm Aaron Stark, and I'm joined by my colleague, Marco Hadi, who is gonna help us dig into Azure Cosmos DB and how it's transforming AI app development. Marco, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me, Aaron. And thanks for joining us. Now, let's get started with an overview of Azure Cosmos DB. What can you tell us about it? Sure, Aaron. At its core, Azure Cosmos DB is a fully managed and distributed NoSQL and vector database designed for modern development. Um, one thing that makes it special is that developers don't need to manage a data model separately using a database tool. Instead, they can define the data model right in their application code using a flexible uh, JSON format. Got it. I mean, that sounds like a comprehensive solution that really simplifies database management. But I'm also curious about performance and scalability. I know that those are critical factors in building intelligent apps. Good point. Uh, that's where Azure Cosmos DB really shines, Aaron. Developers don't need to worry about sizing storage or compute. Azure Cosmos DB automatically distributes uh, resources, providing both exceptional performance and dynamic scalability with high availability and low latency service level agreements. Plus, developers can start with a serverless option for cost savings and scale automatically as their needs grow. Together with the benefits of a managed database service, this brings significant cost savings compared to self-hosted options. I mean, I can only imagine. Those performance and cost benefits are very compelling. Now, let's shift specifically to AI applications. I know that AI apps present some unique data challenges. So I'm curious, how does Azure Cosmos DB address those? That's true, Aaron. AI apps, especially chatbots, uh, typically handle lots of unstructured data. And Azure Cosmos DB, as a NoSQL database, is a perfect fit for this purpose. One of its standout features is how it enables seamless integration of vector search capabilities within a unified database. This means your operational data and vectorized data coexist and stay in sync, eliminating the need for a separate vector database. Azure Cosmos DB also supports real-time data ingestion and querying, which is crucial for AI apps where freshness of data can have huge impact on the relevance of generated responses. Got it. I mean, that makes sense given that the real-time aspect is definitely important for building those responsive AI experiences. Um, can you elaborate a little bit more though on how else Azure Cosmos DB helps facilitate those AI app development moments? Absolutely. Azure Cosmos DB integrates seamlessly with popular AI frameworks such as Langchain and Semantic Kernel, as well as Azure AI services, including Azure OpenAI. This integration makes it straightforward for developers to build generative AI apps and agents. Essentially, it reduces the complexity of connecting your database layer with your AI components. It also makes AI accessible. If you just try uh, Azure Cosmos DB for your AI application, you can start with the free tier. And I mentioned serverless earlier. That's a great option for your development environment. And later you can scale up your production, uh, even to global scale. Ah, I mean, that sounds incredible. And I know all of our developers watching are probably eager to get started. <laughs> what are some resources, if any, that might be available for our viewers um, who want to build AI apps? Could you share some more about that? Yes, absolutely. So uh, one especially valuable resource I'd like to highlight is the developer guide for Azure Cosmos DB. The guide walks you through creating intelligent solutions that combine Azure Cosmos DB for NoSQL, vector search capabilities powered by DiskANN, and Azure OpenAI using the Python programming language. It takes you through the complete developer journey of building a GPT-based chat application from concept to solution with guidance that's clear and practical. And for all you MongoDB developers, there's a version of the guide made just for you. That guide teaches you how to build an AI-powered chat application using data stored in vCore-based Azure Cosmos DB for MongoDB. 
I love that you have something for all different flavors of developers. And it sounds like it's a perfect way that devs can actually put into practice everything that we've been talking about today. And for our developers who might prefer a more structured learning approach, are there any resources or additional training paths and learning plans that might be available for them? Absolutely. There's a fantastic learning path on Microsoft Learn, all about building a Gen AI application with Azure Cosmos DP. This learning path teaches you how to interact with JSON data stored in Azure Cosmos DP for NoSQL using the Data Explorer in Azure Portal, and how to use the SDKs for .NET, Python, and Node.js. You learn how to retrieve and process data efficiently, and then apply these skills to build an AI-powered app. It's perfect for those who want guided, step-by-step -step instructions with hands-on exercises. Again, very comprehensive, I'm loving all of these resources. And what would you recommend for our viewers and developers who might actually want to know even more about Azure Cosmos DB for next steps? I'd strongly encourage viewers, viewers to check out the developer guides on GitHub and the learning path on Microsoft Learn. These resources will give you the skills you need to start building powerful AI applications with Azure Cosmos DB. I also like to mention Azure Cosmos DB Conf 2025. Uh, that's a free virtual developer event co-hosted by Microsoft and the Azure Cosmos DB community. These sessions dive deeper into everything we talked about today about AI app development and much more. And you can watch those sessions on demand. I mean, that's fantastic, Marco. Uh, thank you for joining us today. Thank you for sharing all of these incredible resources and all of your knowledge about Azure Cosmos DB. Thanks for having me, Aaron. A pleasure. And for our viewers, you can find the links to all the resources that we discussed today in the description below. Make sure that you give us a like and you subscribe so you don't miss when a new episode drops. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time on the Azure Essential Show.